Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. It's Mary Ann. I live in Westchester, New York. I live in Zone 7A. This afternoon, after work, I'm going to plant this beautiful flower. It will be my first time to plant this flower. Um, this is hardy to negative uh, 40. And it has a beautiful um, pink color flower. Of this is from 8 uh, to 18 inches tall. And this attracts uh, butterflies. And I don't see any butterfly in my garden. I only see birds and bees. So that's the reason why I bought this. I wanted butterflies to come into my garden. I already dug a hole here. And I, I, I ran out of the biotone. So I'm going to use this. Plant them. I'm going to put a little bit there. And this one requires full sun. And this area where I'm going to plant is plant this is a full sun area. I already watered this, but it looks like it's drying so fast in this this container. So it is above a little above the ground, so I don't want it to root rot. And we'll see how it how this will grow. So I'm just going to I'm going to put some water underneath. Then I'm going to cover it with the soil. And then I'll water it. So I just planted um, the Celine bush. It attracts butterflies. So I'm going to pair it with this Pugster pink. Beautiful color. Pink. And this is, this is dwarf. This is only uh, two feet tall. Hardy to zone five to nine. And it's a deer resistance which I don't have any deer here and um, it likes full sun to part shade and this area is full sun this is a petite shrub so let me plant this one now I already dug the hole here and I, I bought this several days ago and I already wa I watered it and it's still dry it's still it's wet now it's not that dry so I'm going to put it here it's above the the crown because I don't want any root rot and I'm just going to put back the soil
where the water is. So in this area, I'm hoping that the butterflies will come here. Just going to put some mulch around it. Mulch. Keep the moisture.